played it a year on Broadway, and because I was a replacement, five of us went in at the same time. We had only rehearsals with the stage manager, and it was basically blocking and uh, learning the lines. And uh, that, I have to say, is not the way that I work. I usually learn the lines very late and try to understand the play and just poke along slowly into an understanding of what I'm doing. But in this case, I didn't have a chance to understand anything, and I basically didn't understand anything. <laughs> I knew the lines, and uh, that was about it, and got shoved out there after three weeks. So. When we were going on tour, we have an entirely new company, but we had a three-week rehearsal period with the playwright, who is also an actor and is very articulate and very precise about what he wants in the play. And with uh, not the original director, but Amy Morton, who had played the original Barbara and is a director from Chicago, but also an actress. So she did the directing because Anna Shapiro was adopting a baby. And uh, Tracy and she did, we had a whole rehearsal period. So it was very good for me because I learned a lot <laughs> about the play that I'd never, and they'd say, why are you doing that? And I'd say, I'm doing that because I learned that and I'm doing it. I mean, I haven't a clue why I'm doing anything. If you've got a better idea, tell me. <laughs> And I've been playing it, I played it a year on Broadway, and then I had this rehearsal period, and uh, we opened here. And then just two or three days ago, all of a sudden, it, uh, it just clicked in one night in the uh, dinner scene, you know, which is the, uh, I was happy that the Denver critics said that that was a, a, a great, great theatrical speech in the dinner scene. It was nice that, uh, that critic recognizes the value of the characterization because uh, Tracy's really created incredible characters who can just work on them forever and, and never, I don't know, maybe eventually I will find all the nuances, but, but not yet. But just uh, one time, it's a very, very difficult scene. And um, all of a sudden, all the things just uh, worked right, right up to the thing. And the, Climax, climax came just right, and, uh, and so I knew that I had uh, reached uh, like the groove, you know, with this character because I didn't care anymore whether the audience liked it or didn't like it or where I was or where I was and it was just there, you know. I work very uh, unconsciously. I never know anything I do or anything, but I, I knew that that had just worked, and then it it did carry through the rest of the play, and I think it's uh, not, a, not really stayed with me all the time because the material is too difficult and there are too many other people to connect with and they are each one on their own little journey. It's a tough play, you know. It's three and a half hours, but I'm only actually on the stage 90 minutes, so that's not a long play for me or anybody else who's been working all their life in the theater, you know, so. I'm very glad I did, it's been an incredible experience. <laughs>